Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another edition of Telescope Man. Well, I just want to update you today on uh, how I'm doing uh, with some of my awards. You can see uh, some of them in the background I've got hung up. Uh, over the last couple of years, uh, basically been trying to get as many awards as I can get of various different types. Been concentrating on both EQSL and uh, LOTW, both of them. And in some of my previous videos, you've seen how I do that and try to go for awards at both of the sites uh, at the same time. Uh, my technique for doing that is a little uh, old-fashioned and outdated, but it seems to be working just fine. Let me kind of take you through some of the awards I've got. Uh, as of today, this will be November of 2016, I've got eCanada from EQSL, which is working all the provinces, provinces, provinces in Canada, if I can say that word. I've got uh, Continents of the World, uh, which is for working all the continents. Uh, that one came from QRZ. <coughs> But I'll, I have the continents on uh, LOTW and also EQSL, but I uh, haven't been able to find any uh, awards for that on those two sites. So I went over to uh, QRZ and got that award. On the back wall over there, you can see I've got uh, uh, EQSL's Worked All States. Uh, which means I've contacted someone in every state in the United States, in, including uh, Hawaii, of course, and Alaska. I also have uh, LOTW, ARRLs, worked all states. I've got it three ways now. I've got it mixed, which means a combination of digital and uh, voice. And I've got it on 20 meters. In other words, I uh, worked everybody using the 20 meter band. And I also have one that's just called phone, uh, which means I've worked all states uh, using just voice. I'm two states away on LOTW for working all states JT65 right now really should uh, sit down and try to get that. It's, I'm lacking North Dakota and Hawaii, which shouldn't be that difficult on JT-65, but I haven't actually sat down and uh, spent some time uh, just trying to get a contact in those two places. Maybe they'll come automatically just when I'm operating one day. Who knows? Anyway, that would give me a fourth uh, work to all states. I've also got the E-Grid from EQSL, which is for working uh, 350 grid locations in the, in the USA. I think I've got, uh, on that award, I've got 371 grids, uh, which gave me the e Grid Award. <clears throat> I also got a little award from uh, the ARRL back when they had the uh, little contest going on, the Centennial Contest for, uh, and they were given points for that. I got a level two uh, point total uh, on that. Uh, really didn't work that hard. Uh, did happen to hit a couple of big ones. Uh, some of the uh, section directors, uh, which had a lot of points and kind of helped me along in getting the number of points for that particular award. So, uh, working on DXCC, which is uh, 100 entities or countries, if you want to call them that. Some of them are not really countries, uh, like Alaska counts as an entity. But uh, I'm at 87 countries as of November. And the last few are kind of tough to get. I did pick up a few during this recent contact, contest. Uh, a few weeks ago, I picked up a couple of three more entities. 
and I'll just keep working on that. I need 13 more uh, entities to give me my DXCC. <clears throat> and at that point, I'll be mostly filled out with the, the most common awards that are given. And I'll probably start working on different bands for work all states, all the various different bands. That'll probably be my next one that I kind of work on after I get my DXCC. So anyway, that's where I stand right now. And... Uh, been a real enjoyable experience to be able to talk to people from all over the world and all over the USA. Anyway, that's all for today. I encourage you if you don't, uh, if you're not right now interested in trying to get some awards and you're kind of uh, burned out on radio, it might be a way to get re-interested in amateur radio, trying to get some awards, uh, various types, and put them on the wall in your ham shack like I've done. Anyway, everybody be good, and see y'all later. And like I usually say, keep looking up to see the greatest show on earth right over your head every <laughs> single night. Y'all be good. Clear skies in 73. Yeah.